is our new electric shovel. So it's a Hitachi EX3600. So it's around about 360 tonnes. So it runs off a 1200 kilowatt electric motor. And the machine itself, uh, the bucket is 22 cubic metres. And where the operator sits, he's around about seven metres in the air. So what we're hoping to achieve with this machine is an average production of somewhere between 2,500 and 3,000 tonnes an hour. And what we're hoping is that we'll be doing about a million tonnes a month with this machine alone. This implementation of this electric shovel for us at Oceana Gold is a very significant step to us achieving that sustainable mining future and achieving our stated goal of being net carbon zero by 2050 and with a 30% reduction by 2030. Our expectation with this machine is that it'll be completely carbon neutral from a loading point of view. So, and that's because the New Zealand electricity grid is on average a little bit over 80% from renewable sources. But in practical level, at the bottom of the South Island, it's 100% renewable. Because all of the power generation assets in the South Island are all renewable, whether that be hydro or wind. Now, what we're expecting from this machine is we'll be abating around about 3,600 tonnes of carbon dioxide equivalent every year. I think there is a conceivable future where all of the open bit loading machines are electric, so you can get them quite a lot smaller and you can get them a lot bigger, so conceivably you can power every bit of loading equipment with electricity. But it's a really important first step for us here at McRae's and for the wider company. And one of the things that we think we'll be able to achieve with this machine is just show people that it is possible to install such a machine into an existing mine and also be productive as well. This project is just one of a series of examples of constant innovation that we've had here within McRae's mine and also within Oceana Gold as a whole. And I'm sure it won't be the last. Um, there'll be other things that we haven't even thought of yet that are yet to come and hopefully we'll be mining here at McRae's for a long time to come.